Remember that systems of equations are sets of equations that have variables with the same values. For example, here we have a system of equations. 3y equals 2x minus 2, and 4 equals, sorry, 4 minus 4x equals y. The solution of a system of equations is called an ordered pair in the format x, y. That is, the x's in both of these equations are the same, and the y's in both of these equations are the same. Here we have some graphs of some quadratic equations. We have, for example, a line, a parabola, an ellipse, and a circle. Let's say that we have two quadratic equations and we graph them both on the coordinate plane. A solution to that system is any point where they intersect. For example, this line and this parabola intersect at the point 0, negative 4, so this so the solution to this quadratic system would be 0, negative 4. Here we have a line intersecting a circle at two points. In this case, our quadratic system would have two solutions, one at each of these green points. Here we also have a line in a circle graphed on a coordinate plane, but there is no intersection. That means that this quadratic system would have no solution. Quadratic systems are sets of quadratic equations that have variables with the same values. Here we have a quadratic system, y minus x squared equals 2, and x plus 2y equals 1. The solution of a system of equations, a quadratic system of equations, is called an ordered pair in the format x, y. There may be multiple, or no, solutions. Let's take our two equations and get them ready for graphing. The first one we solve for y. We have y equals x squared plus 2. The second we work out and also solve for y. Now we have y equals 1 minus x over 2. Now let's graph these on the coordinate plane. First we have a parabola that opens upwards and has a y-intercept of 2. The second equation is the equation of a line. Because our quadratic equations in this quadratic system do not have an intersection on the graph, this quadratic system has no solutions.